when you're shipping fresh materials, it's a whole different game. You can't just say like, oh, it'll be there in two more days. Like if it's in the box for two more hours, it's going to die. After starting her own floral design company in 2018, Holly Simmons has experienced plenty of issues with the postal service over the last year. We've seen slower shipping times from our suppliers, slower shipping times to our customers. Flowers and supplies often arriving late, leading Simmons to make some recent changes. We actually hit pause on mailing anything. It became such a hassle. After our region saw on-time delivery rates plummet last year, on Tuesday, Postmaster General Louis DeJoy unveiled a 10-year plan that could bring even more issues, all to fix a $160 billion shortfall. The plan calls for slowing the delivery window for first-class mail from two to three days to three to five. Some post offices would see their operating hours cut, and postage prices are likely to rise. The announcement came after President Biden recently named three nominees for the Postal Board of Governors, which has the power to replace Louis DeJoy. I'm sure there's opportunity to help shape this plan going forward, to help frame things differently. The Postal Service once again contemplating changes, possibly impacting the companies and people that rely on it. I'd be hesitant to trust the post office just yet, but it might be something we try again another time. Tom Dempsey, WUSA 9.